It was almost 75 years ago, on August 19, 1947, that the city of Nuremberg was the place of an historic declaration. When the judges of the military tribunal against the leading medical officers in the Nazi administration passed their verdict. They issued what has become known as the Nuremberg Code since then. The court laid out 10 basic principles which must be observed to satisfy moral, ethical, and legal concepts. Informed consent and the right to opt out are two principles of the Nuremberg Code. Today, when the entire world population is being made participants in a gigantic medical experiment of uncertain outcome, it is about time to commemorate the historic declaration that was issued to the world 75 years ago. I invite you to come to Nuremberg or join us online on August the 20th, 2022, when I, together with other doctors, scientists, lawyers and concerned citizens, will reiterate what in the face of monstrous atrocities the court issued that resounding condemnation of coercive, mandatory and ill-informed, inhumane experiments. The New England Journal of Medicine wrote in 1997 on the occasion of the 50th anniversary, informed consent, the core of the Nuremberg Code, has rightly been viewed as the protection of subjects' human rights. The key contribution of Nuremberg was to merge Hippocratic ethics and the protection of human rights into a single code. Now, mere 25 years later, it is about time that we, you and I, will assemble in Nuremberg to remind captured regulators and the general public of this important fact. Where there is risk, there must be a choice. Informed consent and the right to opt are two principles of the Nuremberg Code. Today, the entire world population is being forced to participate in a terrifying medical experiment, the outcome of which we already know is going to be tragic. All nations must stand up and reproclaim the historic declaration that was issued 75 years ago to prevent and ban barbarism forever from our world.